Howdy folks, Synthetic Mason here. Today we brick it up with Dino Tracks. That's right, it's um, the beginning of my own creation, Autobots and Decepticons. Uh, this feisty little guy happens to be a Decepticon. Um, but I, I've, I've, I've got something in the works, we'll just say that. Um, may or may not be a team of Autobots and Decepticons unrelated to, or maybe slightly related to, known Autobots and Decepticons, um, but nonetheless, um, I want to go for not exactly done a hundred times um, alt modes. So, for instance, Dinotrax here is a kind of beefy, could be Kawasaki, Ninja, Crotch Rocket, super fast motorcycle guy rages on the road but yeah um so he is sort of the low level um kind of brash punkish member of my decepticon gang um i'm not gonna make too big of teams but uh you know five or six i think would be a solid number um i work a ton not a lot of time Still haven't unpacked everything, so this could take a minute. Um, I'm going to also try and mix in the remaining Transformers that I have to review. But, on to Dino Tracks. So Dino Tracks is this awesome little motorcycle. Relatively minifigure scale. Um, you can't ride it unless you want to do like, Oh my god, it's going so fast, I'm flying off the back of the bike. Kind of thing. Um... There's people, I've seen people do techniques where they do, like, they take the minifigure's legs off and they somehow reattach them so it looks like they're on there, but that's, that's hard. Um, but yeah, on to Dino Tracks Transformation. Um, so I did my lady bikes and I really wanted legs on a motorcycle transformer. So that's what I did, like, focused on for this guy. Um, for Transformation, we're going to begin by bringing back the back tire and then you'll see that kicks out the what would have been the right side tire cover but now it's kind of a spike on his back weird I don't know what's going on there um, we're gonna come up to the front and bring forward the handlebars bring also back the front tire and continue the handlebars all the way back rolling the literal handlebars as you go now we're gonna turn him into sort of this position going to bring down his legs which is the sort of front plastic chassis of the bike taking shape um, we'll bring out these pieces which are his arms don't fall apart on me and then uh, we'll bring down these exhaust flat on his chest And then drop down his head. And there we have Dino Tracks. Kind of a dinosaur e Decepticon looking Transformer guy. Um, so I had this like kind of Stegosaurus back to him where he's got like the whipping tail with spikes on it, handlebars, um, the tails, which are kind of also spike, and then the big spike on his like back hump hunch um he's got these weird little almost raptor arms and then to make sure he had the uh sort of reptilian head i inverted a black panther head crest which gives him nice little fangs on his face yeah pretty mean so that's a dino tracks uh, like I said, he's the beginning of what will be a sort of rogue team of Autobots and Decepticons fighting one another on Earth. Um, I've got plans. Uh, I think it'll be cool. Uh, plus, this is, like, with the exception of, like, the very first Transformer I ever made, which sadly I do not have. Um, I've really never dabbled in my own Transformer creations, so this is a fun little journey. Um so be looking forward to those. 
So Dynatrax, folks, thanks for watching. Don't forget to uh, let me know what you think. Bye.